Hi, I'm Alice and this is my Frugal Wonderland and today I have a few online crafty hauls to show you guys. So I did or do a couple orders online for Mother's Day because they had a few Mother's Day sales and then also a couple weeks back I did pick up a couple D stashes that I saw on YouTube so I'll go ahead and share what I got from those D stashes as well. So starting off with I did pick up a few items at scrapbook.com. They had like a discount code for Mother's Day I want to say so I did pick up a few items items and they had their adhesive on sale and they also restocked on my favorite adhesive tape so I definitely want to stock up on that. First off I picked up two packs of these four A4 sheets of uh, sticky specs. I actually picked up a pack of these at the scrapbook expo um, a couple months ago and I absolutely love these things. These were on sale for like seven dollars or something like that. It was something pretty inexpensive on um, scrapbook.com so I decided to go ahead and grab two packs because I absolutely love this stuff and since it was on sale I decided um, to just restock on that. So they finally restocked on my favorite adhesive tape. So these are the regular double-sided adhesive rolls that are from scrapbook.com and this is the one fourth inch ones. I use these ones all the time. Um, this is my favorite size to use and they're fairly inexpensive and they work really well so I decided to stock up. I got two of their multi-packs of the one fourth inch because like I said I use these all the time. Each roll comes with um, 81 feet so I definitely wanted to grab a bunch of these and then um, I also picked up their 1 8 inch pack there so I went ahead and grabbed those and then I decided to go ahead and grab another bottle of this Nuvo glue this is the four ounce pack and like I said they had a sale on their adhesive and there was a coupon code so um, I also picked this up at the Scrapbook Expo just to try it and I absolutely love it. So um, I decided to go ahead and pick that up while it was on sale. And then while I was on their site, I just decided to check out their sales section. Um, I picked up this here. These are the little flower centers in like this mint green. And then they had this like olive green also. So I picked up those. I think those were like a dollar or something. And then I found this light chipboard embellishment set um, it was this like crossbones one and I thought this would be fun to embellish I don't remember how many it comes with I think it comes with like five pieces but this was pr pretty inexpensive as well next I just grabbed these little um, sticker set here a little Disney one. I thought it was cute so I went ahead and grabbed that. Next I found this super cute set of chipboard um, memory decks cards. I'm pretty sure these were on sale too but it's a set of three. We have Minnie, Mickey, and then the stars one. So I thought that was super cute. So I decided to go ahead and grab a pack of those because um, hello, yes, Disney and their memory decks cards. So I thought those would be fun to embellish. And then of course, scrapbook.com usually has like a free gift with purchase. And um, they had this patterned butterfly four piece set that came with the order. So that is everything I actually picked up at scrapbook.com. Next, Scrap Diva Designs actually had a Mother's Day sale as well and it was at 20% off. I only picked up two items. There was a bunch of things that I was thinking of getting but I actually got a bunch of dies from AliExpress recently. I'll show that in another haul but um, I picked up this flower die set. I thought these were really nice and um, this was the rose die set and yeah I thought they were really pretty and I wanted more flower options in my collection so I grabbed that and the next item I picked up was her mini Memdex card set and I think this is such a great deal because it comes with three different mini Memdex cards and then also a bunch of little um, 
little extra dies come within it as well so I thought this was fun and definitely wanted to add this to my I definitely want to add this to my collection because I don't have any mini Memdex card dies so I decided to go ahead and grab those and that's the only things I grabbed at Scrap Diva Designs let me go ahead and clear up some space and I'll show you what I got for the D stashes I picked up. So the first D stash I picked up was from Rebecca Creates here on YouTube. I'll go ahead and link her in the description below. I've grabbed some of her D stashes before. Um, I believe she's moving. So she is going through her craft room and um, D stashing a bunch of items. So if you aren't following her, definitely give her a follow because um, she has some really amazing D stashes. I decided to pick up this kind of like mystery bag of embellishments. I think I paid $20 um, total. That's with shipping. So first off, there's these two packs of die cut stickers. They are used, so some are missing, but um, yeah, so there are these ones here. Next we have some peel and stick little mirrored um, um, feathers. Then we have this pack of love buttons. And then we have this really cute pack of um, frames. They're like mint colored frames. This is really cute. I think this is probably, it looks like it's from Michaels or something, but for $1.50, that's not bad. These things are really cute. Then we have a pack of this like mint colored um, aluminum, I guess, foil pack. It says 24 sheets. I don't think all 24 is in there. I could be wrong, but it's like this green pack. And then we have this feather. It's like a pink feather. Then we have this pack of felt flowers. So we have purple, uh, mint, and pink i don't know if these are the ones from dollar tree they might be or they might be from somewhere else and then we have some um, more feathers this one has like a leopard print and then these long feathers here they're like bright colored feathers we have some random um, stickers i think those are from a dollar tree pack another butterfly one and then there's this little um, thanks tag floating around. Then we have this vintage little card. Then we have some borders. And then we have this pack of um, paper clips. Then we have a pack of clear tags. It has that um, Hello Gorgeous one and also this um, heart one. Yeah, it looks like both are in there. Those are cute. Then we have some metal corner pieces and then this like metal frame set. Then these metal little cocktail pieces. Those are cute. Then we have this really fun pack of tags. Okay, these are the designs that come with it. Those look fun. Definitely can use those. We have a pack of three different sized little ladybugs. There's a bunch of different designs and sizes of doilies. So just a bunch of different ones that were in the box. So tons and tons of doilies, more doilies, just a bunch of different colors. I don't really have that many doilies in my collection, so I am happy to have those. We have this little pocket here. And then this set of little pearl bands. We have a bunch of buttons. These are cute. These um, little ephemera stickers. Then we have this like pack of like pastel ephemera pieces. Looks like a bunch of different ones. Then there's a pack of these little Polaroid um, frames. They look like that. Then there's this little cork, um, almost like a coaster and says you can do it with a little coffee cup. So it looks like we have a couple of those little um, envelopes. I have some stickers that kind of look like this as well. I think that would be fun to make a like ATC card or, or something to slip it in. I'm not sure if an ATC card would fit in there. It might be like really snug, but I think those are cute. Another one, we have some stickers 
some die cut little um, banners some more little die cut pieces definitely can use those and then we have a bunch of die cut sentiments this is awesome um, definitely can use those another little doily it's a little mini one we have a pack of these tags that have um, the gold foil around them this little mini like glassine envelope and then some a random little um, cabochons and charms in here so these are just the little charms and cabochons that are in here just a bunch of random ones i'm not sure what these are but they're in there then some random little ephemera pieces then just some random things at the bottom of the bag more ephemera pieces another vintage inspired one it's actually two in there little tag some tickets and then just some random letter pieces in there so that is everything from rebecca creates um little d stash this is the ephemera pack i think for 20 bucks that's not bad i think i got a lot of stuff so let me go ahead and grab my last d stash so the last d stash i got was from the crafty bean here on youtube i've also picked up a few d stashes from her as well i'll have inf her information in the description below this pack might not be that exciting but i was really excited to grab it so i've been really wanting more solid cardstock i know i can get a bunch at um michael's when they go on sale pretty cheap or or even hobby lobby but um i saw that she put this up i decided to go ahead and grab it so it was a big box of solid cardstock for i believe it was 48 dollars uh, she said most of them were that the basil or basil cardstock so i thought that was totally worth it i absolutely love their cardstock so um this one was a bunch of the swiss dots ones and i have do i do have a few of these in my collection and i love them so i was really happy to see that she had a bunch of this textured cardstock so there is a bunch of those ones and then we have some more textured cardstock here i'm just going to quickly flip through i just love the quality of basil or basil i don't know how you say it um their cardstock it's just nice thick textured cardstock and i don't have a lot of these colors in my collection so i'm very happy to have picked this up because i definitely can use solid cardstock and i feel like i have a lot of printed but not a lot of um, solid i love that blue definitely can use that then we have an unopened pack of um the pink cardstock and it says it's a 50 pack so definitely can use pink even though pink is not my favorite color i actually use pink a lot in crafting so definitely can use that then we have a 50 pack of the white unopened so very nice happy to have that then we have a 48 sheets um pack of memento cardstock and it's just this really pretty cardstock. Um, it says textured cardstock. So there's just some really pretty colors in there. Um, it looks like it might be um, white core, not solid core, but I love the colors in here. I definitely don't have these colors, so very happy with that. And then we have two packs of um, these 50 piece crafters companion cardstock. I was really excited to get this. Um, these ones were brand new as well and they're just regular solid cardstock really pretty colors i am so happy to have these and yeah i mean i love good quality cardstock and i think these are great quality here's the other 50 pack so just nice matte cardstock lots of pretty colors and I will definitely put these into good use. And that is everything that I picked up on my little online crafty haul. So if you guys like this haul, go ahead and like and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below telling me what you think. All right, guys, till the next one. Bye.